Hello everyone, so I finally got through the third season of The Cuphead Show on Netflix. So of course, if you don't know about it by now, the hit awesome, super great video game that came out a few years ago, Cuphead, got turned into an animated Netflix series that is just beautiful in its style, so true to the games in terms of the music, the characters, the boss battles, like everything just translates absolutely perfectly and I loved the first two seasons of this show. So. Third season came out a little shorter than the um, past couple seasons, so it's 11 episodes long as opposed to, I believe the first season was 13, the second was 12, and now this one is 11 episodes. But um, yeah, I'm going to go through my review, very quick overview, um, spoiler free, all of that stuff for season three of Cuphead on Netflix. So yes, let me get into it. So as I said too, in terms of how true this is to the games, and again, adapting the style of the video games to the small screen <laughs> Netflix I found has been absolutely perfect. I love the characters of Moogman, Bugman, <laughs> and Cuphead. Um, I just found that they absolutely captured the style, the time, the art style, um, all the characters so perfectly. And it just translates onto the screen in such great ways and ways that make me love the characters of, of well, everyone in this. Elder Kettle, the boss fights, Chalice, Cuphead, Mugman, um, the devil, King Dyer. Ice makes his uh, reappearance in this um, season, which I was really, really excited to see. They give definitely a lot more emphasis and a lot more for the devil's henchmen to do in this. And I found, too, just the way that they've been able to weave the devil's storyline and make him actually a very compelling and fun-to-watch character that sometimes you even want to root for <laughs> um, was very, very great. And um, again, they just continue building upon the world in such a great way. And it's just, I love this show so much. I definitely think that it is the best animated show that they have on Netflix. Um, it's really, really good. Or the best running one that they have on Netflix. It's just so great in so many ways. And um, one addition that I really, really like to the season is that episodes five and six, I'll kind of do a little bit of a breakdown of the episodes here in a little bit, but episodes five and six are Christmas episodes. And I found that it was just a very, very fun style to bring into this game. And the fifth episode is something really really fun just hilarious um between cuphead and mugman trying to find the perfect christmas tree and again find the meaning of christmas through this adventure that they have is some super funny super goofy and i just really 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 like the style of it and then the sixth episode is almost like a grinch like story for the devil in terms of him being able to make it on the nice list <laughs> instead of being on the naughty list and um uh it's a mix between like the santa claus movies and the grinch where i just found it was absolutely hilarious and again too something just awesome for the character development of the devil in this and something again too that makes you root for him and really really like him in a lot of ways <laughs> so again too it, it just really build upon the characters and everything within this world and the show that they have again put into play and i found that the sixth episode so the one with again to the the devil <laughs> being uh again taking on this role in this story was easily the best episode of the season just very very good and i can't do just an absolute standout um overall i do think this was a bit of a weaker season compared to the other two but again too i gave both up or both seasons i believe nines out of tens when they came out earlier this year um and <laughs> this definitely i don't want to say like when i say it's a step down it's still incredible and absolutely amazing to what this show has been able to accomplish so far, and I still highly recommend it. It's an amazing season, just full of great laughs, um, great character developments. Just again, too, the, just the style that they have in this is so unique, and I love it so much. And I just, again, too, I feel like it translates absolutely perfectly. So I'm just going to switch the camera up here. So, yes um each episode as you can see most of them are around like the 15 minute mark but there's a couple here so the sixth episode that i really really like just half an hour long it's awesome <laughs> but uh and then again too a couple of them are 20 like plus 20 minutes long but most of them around like the 15 minute mark and um it's just so good so it's very easy to sit down and binge through this in a sitting or two to watch it um, and again, just I highly recommend it. But um, yeah, the first episode picks up exactly like not even a second after where season two left off on the big cliffhanger that they have. And then, yeah, there's a couple just filler episodes until it gets to the Christmas episodes and kind of bounces off one to another. And then um, again, too, there's a bit more few filler episodes with 
tiny little bits of story that evolve into, again, just the final two episodes here, where we get a lot more of Chalice's character, which I really, really like, because Frenchie's a very, very good dynamic character, and um, it makes for a very, very fun, goofy, and hilarious <laughs> season finale that, um, again, too, they can really build upon a lot when it comes to the next couple seasons, and they do a bit of a time jump in that. So very, very excited to see where season four is going to take us, and I really hope that we just, again, too, I've been so impressed with how this show has been able to uh like the first season came out in i believe it was february the second one came out like four or five months later and now we have season three four or five months later so i was a little worried that they were rushing production of the show in a lot of ways and it was going to falter because of that but it hasn't at all they've just been able to keep making the show absolutely incredible <laughs> in just every single form of the way it's damn near perfect in a lot of ways and again so season three just definitely continues that in a lot of ways and just again to really took the time to um might not be the most uh, again if you're comparing it to the past few seasons might not be as entertaining in a lot of ways but they were able to swap a little bit of that out for some amazing character developments that is going to again to just make the seasons to come i think even better <laughs> and um if they can keep building upon that it's it's, I can't see, it's already an incredible show and it's just going to keep getting better and better and better from here on out so really with everything taken together i have to give season three of cuphead in eight out of ten I just absolutely loved it, and I thought it was so incredible, so awesome in every single way. It's great for, I truly believe, all ages, young, middle-aged, old, millennial, whatever you want to classify it as. It's very, very great, and it has something for absolutely everyone in every single episode. The humor is great. The storytelling is great. The animation is great. I just I love this show so much, and truly, I recommend it to absolutely anybody and everybody and yeah it's just very strong season once again for the cuphead show so if you've seen season three or any of the cuphead show on netflix please let me know what you thought about it in the comments down below and of course if you like this review definitely give it a thumbs up and you can check out everything i do on this channel through our playlist down below and all links on the top here for convenience sake thank you for subscribing turn that little ringer on so you know when i upload new videos and go and check out the uh, description of this video and my channel bio there's a link to the media mountain which is my discord where we talk about movies video games comic books tv pretty much everything that's awesome in this world so you can definitely join that amazing community help make it even more amazing than this already today and yeah just awesome guys sky blue eyes i see a world behind them no more time sinking into the side